MLB Network's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Tonight, it's the home opener for this new season between the Philadelphia Phillies and the Houston Astros. Two great hitters lead their teams to battle next on MLB Network. Here's Rogan Odor now. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. Leading off tonight for Philadelphia. Second baseman, Rugned Odor. And we are underway from Houston as the first pitch of the night is taken for ball one. And Harold, these Astros entering play here tonight. They come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. Yeah, Matt, it's been disappointing. I mean, here we are in the dog days of August, and this shows your colors right now. I mean, there's been a lot of bickering and complaining, but because they've been playing poorly, and it's hot, and they're all irritable. Uh, it's not a fun club to be around. And he pumps the fastball by him here, one and two now. And this is swung on and missed on a great pitch that time, and the leadoff man is down on strikes to get this one started. With the plate, Odubel Herrera. He enters play hitting in the 260s for the year. Sends that one out of play for strike one. The wind up and the 0 1. I just couldn't pull that one back in time. It's 0 and 2 now. Now the pitch. Shooting for that low inside corner, but he missed with it. One and two. And he lays off it to even the count two and two. And he lays off a pitch off the plate and high. Three and two. Into the windup, ready with the payoff pitch. Hit hard on the ground towards second. Altuve has it. And he'll whip this one over to first, and he gets his man for the second out. Digging in the switch hitter, Billy Burns. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Low for ball one. Ball one, no strike. Here's a high pop-up. Gonzalez is there for it, and that retires the side. Here's Marwin Gonzalez now. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half the of the Astros. first. Third baseman, Marwin Gonzalez. And here's a fastball called for strike one. These Phillies, Harold, as they enter play here tonight, they come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. The short hit hard. No problem here, one away. At the plate, Jose Altuve. He brings an average in the 260s into this one. Ready to deliver, here's the first pitch. And that one stayed too low, apparently. The windup and the 1 0 pitch. Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air over toward foul ground. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. Fouled off again, and now he's in a one and two hole. A ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. 
Here's a looping fly ball out to right. Williams moving to his left. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Batting Here's third. Matt Adams now. He hitter. brings a rather ugly Matt 230s Adams. batting average into this one. In there at the letters 0 and 1. Well, maybe that fooled him, or maybe he wasn't looking for it, but man, he hung him a curveball right there in the middle. For him to not swing the bat, being the power hitter he is, who sees a lot of breaking pitches, makes me think he's looking for something else. Oh, man, he just tied him up in knots right there. And a classic 0 2 pitch as the changeup misses low, and it's 1 and 2 now. And he chased it in the dirt. Alfaro has it. The throw to first is in time, and the inning is over. Digging in, Carlos Santana. He'll lead it off here to begin the second. Carlos Santana. First nope. pitch of the oh. inning is taken low and away for a ball. It's 1 and 0. And the pitch. Looked like he wanted to clobber that one, but it's one and one. Here it comes. And all oh, that looked to catch him flush down near the foot or the ankle. So gets him. So they are able to get an out on an unusual play. And hopefully the pitcher's okay. Now at the plate, Nick Williams. And he'll step off and try again. Now time is called here as we'll get a trip to the mound. First pitch on its way. Yeah. Takes a look at a strike over the inside corner. The 0 1. A fastball right down the middle for a strike. Every time you go out there to start a game on the mound, you hope to settle in quickly and get into a groove. And he's definitely done that so far in the early going. Looks like he could go pretty deep into this one. Decided to go with a fastball there on 0 and 2, but what he's trying to do with that pitch is to expand the strike zone. Maybe you get a guy to offer at it, but at the very least, it helps set up your off speed stuff. Pulled toward right center field. On the move is Reddick. He makes the play. Really had to hustle to get to that one. Two gone now. So digging in now, Scott Kingery hitting a little over 250 coming into action in this one. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. The wind up and the one oh pitch. Took a wave at one around the shins with no luck. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Swing, and that's hit out of play up into the plaza level. Drilled right back up the middle, and that finds its way through for a base hit. So good work on a 1 and 2 count to get on base. Stepping into the box, Dylan Cousins. Dylan Cousins. Pause, now the pitch. And he starts him out with a strike on the outer half. Oh one, here's the pitch. Oh one is a splitter that misses for the first ball. And the reason he's working away so much here is because he's got that big hole on the right side of the infield to worry about with the first baseman holding the runner on. It's always smart to pitch into the defense you have behind you. Couldn't wait back a swing and a miss. The one and two pitch. He's running towards second. Pitch misses low. The throw down. Not in time. He's in there at second. No score here as we play inning number two. And he tried to hold up in time, but to no avail as he went around and the inning is over. In now, Carlos Correa. His average for the year sits in the 280s entering play. Takes a high fastball for a strike. Frozen with a high fastball there. We'll see if they try to climb the ladder even more on the next pitch. And the changeup is way low that time. Tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. 
And a half swing that time, but it's a full swing in the eyes of the umpire, and that'll be the first out of the inning. Batting fifth, first baseman, Justin, Justin Morneau. He's at the plate now, and he's quickly behind 0-1. Boy, not a good swing there. That was really ugly. Anytime you can make a hitter look like that, you've done something special. Now, did it look to you like he was guessing on the pitch? Oh, certainly it had to be, Matt, but if he was, he obviously wasn't looking for that pitch. And a check swing here. They'll point down to the third base umpire, but no swing on that one. It's ball one. Line towards center field. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. Here's the catcher, Brian McCann, hitting just a bit catcher. over the Mendoza line Brian on the year. McCann. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Burns is right there as he'll put it away without much problem for the second out. Here's George Springer. He comes in with 16 home runs Center on the fielder. season so far. George Springer. And they'll try and get him out in front to start the at bat, but this misses off the plate away. It's ball one. Nope. Downstairs, two balls and no strikes. Now with the 2-0 count and the power at the plate, it could be fireworks time. This is the kind of count he makes his money in. Hard hit ball to short. Here's a flip to Odor covering, and the inning is over. So coming to the plate. Alcides Escobar. He'll step in to lead it off two. in the top of the third. And this one's nowhere ball close one, no as that bounces to the plate for ball one. Now the pitch. And there's a pitch that just misses the inside corner. 2 0 pitch on the way. 3 and 0 now. This is not the guy you want to walk right here. Look, the eight hitter, this could set up a big inning if he gets on. And he lays off there, ball four. So the leadoff man is on here to begin inning number three. Batting ninth. So Catcher. striding forward now, Jorge, Jorge Alfaro. Alfaro. And a quick glance at the numbers will tell you it's been a huge struggle for him at the plate this year. Shows bunt as he gets this one down. But a strong throw gets him at second, so the sacrifice does not pay off here. Now batting. Digging in to Second try it again. Rukna Odor. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And the first pitch is chopped foul right at home plate. It's strike one. Ready with the 0 1. And there he goes towards second. Line drive to center field. Springer makes the catch. And now they might be able to double them off at first. Here's the center fielder, uh, Adubal for Herrera. 0 for 1 here field. in the early going. Adubal Herrera. And this one's in the dirt. And he'll make it into scoring position here with two away, as that'll be scored a wild pitch. Third inning, no score to this point. And this one gets away. Good job keeping it close as the count goes to one and one. And here's a fastball not close as he runs it to two and one now. Swing and a line drive. 
And that nearly broke our scoreless tie. Instead, it's a foul ball. Oh, that was a good pitch to hit. It wants that one back. He was just a little bit late on it. And here's a ball hit in the air. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. Pickoff move to second, and he'll get back in standing. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. Pitch is taken, but he rings him up. That's the third out, and it puts an end to the inning. Stepping in is Josh Reddick. He'll look to get something Leading going here in this scoreless ball game. Right fielder, Josh Reddick. And he swings on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. Another one fouled off and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. Reddick waiting and now the pitch. And he checked his swing, but it's a strike three called, and that's the first out of the inning. Batting ninth. Stepping into Left the box, fielder. Brian Goodwin. Brian. The average Good for him entering play sits down in the nope. 250s. Lays off 1 0. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. Swing and a miss out in front of a changeup. Well, clearly he's not sitting changeup with that swing. I like the early changeup. Now it sets up your fastball and all your other off speed stuff because now the changeup, anything's faster than that. He's got him off balance now. The one and two pitch popped high in the air. Sanchez is there for it. And he makes the catch for the second out. Now Riding in once again, Marwin Gonzalez. Marwin He's 0 for 1 Gonzalez. after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Yeah. And that's cut on and missed 0 and 1. Goodness gracious, Matt. 100 miles an hour. No wonder he swung and missed. You're not catching up to that pitch. No way. And that swung on and fouled straight back. Swing and a miss at a big breaking ball, and that's how the inning comes to an end. Digging in, Billy Burns off comes into this at bat 0 for 1 Fielder. in the ball game. Billy into Burns. the windup and the pitch. Swing and a liner. Foul. Oh, that's foul. And oh, he can't get out of the way of that one. So the leadoff man will be on to open the frame. Here's Carlos Santana now. He's 0 for 1 thus far. He's set. Here it comes. And a fastball's off the plate away. It's ball one. Well, if you love pitching and defense, this has been a game for you. Are you happy with that, Dan? I think this continues for a while, Matt. Both of these pitchers are throwing very well, throwing strikes, having good command of their off-speed pitches. This is going to be one of those low-scoring affairs. Now a move over to first and a dive, but he's back in there. Here comes the 2-0 pitch and a pitch out thought he might be moving there but it's a ball three now. He's set here's the 3-0 and this one misses to Santana and he'll take that free pass down to first. Now batting. Ready for another right chance. Fielder. Nick, Nick Williams, Williams 0 for one for him here in this one. And they start him out away with a cold strike. Matt, I don't know if you know this, but less than 60% of his first pitches have been for a strike. And he's still having a good game. I, I don't know what he's doing. They just haven't been able to figure him out. And this one gets away. 
Good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on. Good lead there at second. Here's the pitch. A two seamer there as this is fouled off to the left side. Now a throw over to first and the runner back. No runs just one hit and no errors on the ledger for the Phillies to this point. I uh, got him swinging on the split fingered pitch and that's out number one. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Short Scott Kingery. Scott Kingery. Here's a look over to first and he has to dive but he's back in easily. A decent lead at second. Here's the pitch. Pitch is a cold strike the throw and he's called out on a close play at third. Come set with the 0 and 1. And this is fouled at the plate. That's inside and low. It's a ball and two strikes. Working for the punch out and the offering. And this will be fouled away. Now another one two. Swing and a miss and that ends the inning. Here's the second baseman Jose Altuve. He'll start things inning. out here in a tie second ball game. Baseman, Jose Into the windup and the pitch. And that changeup makes him jump a swing and a miss. Tell you what I'm already taking inventory in the fourth inning here Matt. His secondary pitch has really been effective. He's used it well. He's getting a lot of good results from it. I just wonder if they're going to make an adjustment as the game continues. And this is swung on and missed and this fourth inning will start the same way he ended the third with a strikeout. Well, there's one away. 15, so hitter, stepping in Matt, Matt Adams, Adams looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat and this is in the air down the left field line and into foul territory and this will wind up a foul ball. Oh, he just ramps up and gears the fastball by him. Oh and two. Well, I think his eyes lit up when he saw that pitch coming up at his eye level. Yeah, good luck. But hey, a high fastball all of a sudden becomes really dangerous for a pitcher if it's not spotted above the zone. A little height difference makes all the difference. The next 0 2. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Williams looks up and it's gone. Here's Carlos Correa now. Over one after he took a look at strike three in his first plate appearance. Swing and a miss, but he's right on here. One strike. Now the 0 1. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. And another foul ball. One run, two hits. No errors in the ballgame for the Astros to this point. Very weakly on the ground. That's a foul ball. He takes strike three called on the fastball. Couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. Up next for the Astros. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Good swing. Just got to try and straighten that one out. The wind up and the 0 1. A swing and a miss at the good old Uncle Charlie. That looked like he was cheating for that fastball inside right there. Early swing, got out in front of that off-speed pitch, clearly looking for a fastball. You know, I'm not sure he didn't throw that pitch out of the zone on purpose. They've been swinging at pretty much everything he throws, so why not give it a shot? 
Now a swing and a fly ball. And this will wind up a foul ball. The 2 2 one more time. Chop foul over towards the dugout. Another 2 2 offering. And he struck him out. His seventh of the ball game. And that digging in for his second at bat. Dylan Philly, Cousins comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. First pitch of the inning is taken downstairs for a ball. It's 1 and 0. Pitch on the way. 2 and 0. Boy, that's a great breaking ball right there. That's a tough pitch to lay off when that ball is coming in at that plane right there. Quality take. And he'll lay the fastball in here to get the count back to 2 and 1. Out in front as this is pulled foul into the seats. Even at two balls and two strikes, here's the pitch. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. Well, he's been throwing the ball pretty well so far, but right here, three balls to the leadoff guy to maybe get them a chance to get them going. He's just got to come back, make him swing the bat. I'd rather see him earn his way on the base by swinging the bat instead of a walk. Around second, he's on his way to third. And he is in to third with a leadoff triple. Now batting, Alcides Escobar, two. as he's got a chance to tie Escobar. this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. And he swings through a fastball and doesn't catch up with it. It's 0-1. I'll tell you what, right there, Matt, that's a sign of a guy that was sitting on an off-speed pitch. He threw that fastball right by him. Now the outfield signal to play shallow. We'll see if that works out. 0 oh and 1 count and the pitch. Here's his splitter that's taken for a ball 1 and 1. One and one, here it is. Oh, had a hanger that time, but missed it. One and two. This is where you got to pitch to the strikeout. Infield's drawn in. You don't want contact. You want to make him swing and miss. Throw the nastiest stuff you have. And this one gets away. And a nice job to keep the runners at bay as the count moves to two and two. From the belt, kicks and deals. And he misses with that one down and in. It's a full count now, three and two. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Takes this the other way to right. Reddick has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. And that one just not deep enough, so the Wiseman hold him at third with one out in the inning now. Alfaro. Coming to the plate now, Jorge Alfaro. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Now the outfield signal to play shallow. We'll see if that works out. First pitch of the at bat on its way. And a fastball just below the knees ball one. Skied into very shallow right. Reddick has a read on it. He makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. And he will be tagged out at the plate. So it remains a one. Ready now. Brian McCann Leading will lead things off here in this one run Andrew. contest. Ryan Hit hard on the ground to short. Kingery is right there. And he set down one away. Center Stepping up now, four. George Springer. George 0 for 1 for Springer. him here in this one. Here's the first pitch to him. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. Oh, one pitch on its way. And I'm not sure, but it looks like he may have been blindfolded for that swing. It's 0 and 2 now. Well, you find yourself down 0 and 2, and the last swing you take, 
is a bad swing. It doesn't give you a lot of confidence as a hitter, that's for sure. And he struck him out, and that's eight strikeouts thus far. Swung on, and this ball is absolutely crushed. Forget about it. It's up and out of here, into the archways. Next batter to the plate, Brian Goodwin. He popped out in his first trip. And he'll start him with a high strike here on the fastball on the outside corner. It's 0-1. Man, he's flirting with danger. He gave up a home run on that very same pitch. And this time he comes right back with it in another dangerous location. He better be careful. Well, he went for the knockout pitch that time, but a good eye, one and two. And he's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout number nine here, and the side is retired. Here's Rogna Dodor now. He'll try and get Leading things off, started as we begin inning number second six. Baseman, Hit out towards second. Altuve fields it cleanly. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Now Here's batting. the center fielder, Odubel, Odubel Herrera. Odubel. He comes in 0 for Herrera. 2 thus far. First pitch here misses wide, 1 0. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. That's inside, 2 0. From the windup, the 2 0 pitch. Takes a look at a strike over the inside corner. Well, this offense finds himself struggling right now, and they're down a few runs. They got to try to manufacture, get somebody on, maybe hit and run, and then you look for the big ball. Looks like right now everybody's swinging for the downs. They got to turn it around a little bit, play a little small ball, get it going. Left fielder, ready for another shot now. Billy Burns comes into this at bat, 0 for 1 in the ball game. Tapper up the line. Tell you what, his spot has been the outside pitch right there, and now we're late in the game, and he continues to pound the outside pitch, and it's really working out for him. Throw on to the first baseman, Morno, and the inning is over. Here's Marwin Gonzalez now. He's 0 Leading for 2 for thus far in this one. Third baseman, Marwin. A fastball Gonzalez. off the plate away. It's ball one. The windup and the 1 0 pitch. Now a swing at a ball popped in the air back behind short. Kingery backs up a bit and he takes charge for the first out. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. He's 0 for 2 with a strikeout in this one. And he takes a cold strike, 0 and 1. That's a big pitch right there. Now he's got him 0 and 1. And he still may not be comfortable. Even 0 and 1, he's still a pretty good hitter when he's down the count. This is a big pitch right here. Boy, that's a good pitch right there. The old, old school guys would call that a little bit of chin music up and in. See if he can get him to move off the box a little bit. Hit hard down the line. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at 1 and 2. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Had him off balance a bit as this is skied into short left center. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. The batter, number 15. Ready for another chance. Matt batter. Adams Matt comes in one Adams. for two with that home run he hit earlier. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. And indeed it will. He throws him out at first. And the Digging in once again, Carlos Santana. He's 0 for 1 thus far. First baseman, Carlos Santana. And this one's chopped foul right at home plate. The wind up and the 0 1. Swung on and missed, outclassed by that fastball for a strike. I think a big reason why he's been so effective in this one that he's been just about getting ahead of every hitter. Seems like every one of them are 0 2, 1 and 2, and it's just about every at bat. And when that's the case, your chances of getting a good pitch to hit are way worse. I uh, got him swinging on the split fingered pitch, and that's out right number one. Number five. Nick First delivery Mulligan. to him on the way. Lined into left field, a base hit. Stepping in and ready for another the shot. Batter, 11, Scott Kingery, shortstop. a hit in two Scott tries so Kingery. far. 
Now some action out in the Houston bullpen as it appears both a lefty and a right hander are up to throw. First pitch of the at bat on its way. And that misses ball one. This is the situation where there's a lot of pressure on the infielders if the ball's put in play on the ground. Both the guy at first and at the plate are burners, so a double play is going to be tough. Even getting one out could be a challenge. The 1 0 delivery. Oh, that hit him. Let's hope he's okay. Nice recovery play to get the second out, but we'll have to make sure he's okay on the mound. Trying to pick things up him? where he left Designated off. Hitter. Dylan Cousins. Dylan. He tripled Cousins. earlier, making him one for two in the ball game. Your attention, please. Now so with a left-handed hitter waiting, they'll go to their own left-hander, Matt Holliday. Will come on to Matt pinch hit here in a big spot. And here is strike one call to the 37 year old veteran up there. Nothing in one. And you see that average below the dreaded Mendoza line. Comes set and the 0 1. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Now the Astros have somebody up in the bullpen as a right hander has started to warm up out there. Getting a few steps off a second there. Now the pitch hits sharply toward the right side. Reddick is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Striding in once again. Carlos Correa we thought we might be seeing the end of the road for the starter but clearly he's still in there for at least one more hitter. Well Matt we'll see how this works out but I think they figured with the righty coming up it was worth sticking with him to keep the matchup advantage in their favor here. Justin Morneau. Justin Morneau comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. The wind up and the 0 1 hit down the line at first. But this will be a foul ball as he's behind 0-2 now. Swing and a soft liner. Throw gets him two down. Here's the catcher Brian McCann. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. And he takes ball one. Hey, you can't let that bother him right there. This might be a good time for the catcher to have a little conversation and just tell him. Next pitch. Don't worry about that one. Now this is sprayed foul off to the left and that'll even the count at one and one. Swing and a miss as he pulled the string on him one and two. Wow what makes it so tough to be a hitter is to be able to hit and change his speeds right. You're geared up for the fastball and all of a sudden he pulls the string and throws you the straight change the dreaded equalizer. Another one two delivery. And that's a swinging strike three in the dirt. Alfaro goes to get it, and that ends the inning. Digging in to try it again. I'll see this Escobar. He'll start things out for us here in inning number eight. James Poit has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eight. Now pitching for the Astros, number 51, Shane Hoyt. Starts him out with a slider for a strike. The 0-1 pitch. There's a fastball that just misses ball one. The 1-1 on its way to Escobar. And he misses two and one. He's set and the 2 1 pitch. Flares this one over toward first. But an easy play there at first as that becomes the first out of the now inning. Patrick. Ready once Jorge. again. Jorge Alfaro. Alfaro. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Here's the first pitch to him. Whoa. Hey now. That one's going to find the seats. Strike one. 
Look into McCann, the 1-1. One, one. Two and one. And the pitch on two and one. Ooh, he saws him off with that one. Foul. That's a big fastball, obviously. And we're going to see this reliever throw it a lot. Set to deal on two and two. And that one never threatened the zone. It's gone full now to three and two. Walks are never good, but they're especially bad news late in games like this. It seems like they always come back to bite you. And they will not get him at first as he's able to leg out the throw. Settling in now, Rufnet Odor. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Your attention, please. Now New pitcher coming on now as we'll get a look at the side armor, Joe Smith. Joe Smith. From the stretch. Nope. And That's a bad. fastball just a bit up. Infield shifts now. They'll overload to the right with the shortstop on the other side of the second base bag. From the belt, the pitch. Hot shot towards the hole. But this is hauled in by the second baseman. Here's the center fielder, Odubel oh, Herrera. He could really fielder. use a knock oh, here, 0 oh, for 3 Herrera. in the game so far. Your attention, please. Now so they'll make a matchup the move here and bring on a Number southpaw to face the left handed Tony hitter due up. Seth. First pitch coming, here it is. Hard hit ball towards the hole. And how about that right out of the bullpen? A ground ball on one pitch, and the inning is over. Here's George Springer. He'll see what he can do leading, leading off the, the home eight. Center fielder, George Springer. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. So the Astros put a man aboard to get the inning underway. Stepping in is Josh Reddick. He comes in one right for two fielder. with that. That home run he Josh. hit earlier. So they'll go to the bullpen now, and it'll be the left-hander here. To Number 46, Adam. Alex Bregman. Come on to pinch Number hit now two. with a runner at first Alex and nobody out. Bregman. And now a stoppage here, as it looks like a balk has been called, and indeed they're going to say he never came fully set before starting for the play. He's set and the pitch. A high fastball is in there. Trying to add some padding to their lead in the form of that run standing out there at second base. Swing and a miss and he's quickly in the hole 0 and 2. Here comes the nothing and two pitch. Fly ball to straight away left. Burns is there. One away. And the runner not tagging will retreat to second base. Now batting. Now to the plate, Brian Goodwin. Brian Goodwin. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for play. him to this point. Evan Gaddis will get a chance with a runner in scoring position Evan. here as he'll Gattis. pinch hit now with one away. Checked his go. swing there. Did he go around? No, says the first base umpire. Ball one. Well, they miss with the first one, but then they decide, let's go ahead and just put him aboard here, and they'll do just that. Now batting, third Here's Marwin baseman. Gonzalez now. Marwin He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. Tony Kemp will player. come on now and pinch now run here. For the Astros. Number 18, Tony Kemp. Good breaking ball there. Had him frozen. Strike one. Here comes the 0-1. And he jumps at a changeup, a swing and a miss. That's a good changeup. Got him to swing early in it. Now you got him set up. You can go back with a hard fastball or double it up with another changeup. Hits are now even at four apiece. And the runners again are off here. Swing and a miss, strike three. The throw. Over now, they'll apply the tag between second and third.
digging in the switch hitter, Billy Burns. Leading He'll be charged with trying to get on board, Fielder, leading off the ninth. Billy Ken Giles Burns. comes Your on from the pen, lead. hoping to finish this now one off here in the Astros, top of the ninth. Number 53, Ken Giles. inning begins as the first pitch is taken for ball one. A ball and no strikes. Here it is. Now a good pitch on the inside part of the plate ties him up and it's one and one. He's set. Here comes the one one. This is on the ground over to first and he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Here's Carlos Santana now. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ball game. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And he goes against the shift there as this is on the ground to the left side. Throw on to first will get him. Score at 5-3 on the putout, though it looked more like a 6-3 ground ball. Nevertheless, there are two away now. First pitch of the at-bat. Nick Williams is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. Oh, that's for sure going to be a pitch he wants back. You're not going to get many balls right in the wheelhouse from a top-level arm like this. That's over, but low, it's a ball and a strike. And here's a swing and a miss, so the fills are down to what could be their final strike now. Has them down to their final strike. Here it comes. Philadelphia. Good night. Well, we watched a really solid starting pitching performance. Kept the opposition at bay. And as a result, he's our top's player of the game. Well, it wasn't a particularly long outing, but he really did a nice job of keeping his guys in it while he was out there. That's all you really hope for from your starter. Fans, our final line score tonight. First for the victorious Astros. Two runs on four hits. No errors. They left three men on base. For Philadelphia, no runs.